Hello everyone, it's Kaylee, and I am finally back with another video. Um, the reason why I haven't been, you know, making a lot of videos is because with school, I honestly just don't have the time to do it. School has taken over my life, and it's just been school everywhere. But I had time this weekend to do it. So I did it, and yeah. So, the inspiration for this picture came to me the other night. I wanted to draw my Instagram followers since I didn't know what to draw, and I tried to take a picture of myself making that face, and it, it just didn't, didn't work at all. So, instead, I drew myself doing it, because why not? So in this picture, I have a pencil pressed to my cheek, and I tried to do a sort of thinking face, which kind of works. Um, I'm wearing my for real sweater with much unicorn, and my giant curly hair. And, you know, jeans, because I need those. Um, this was my first time inking like straight onto the paper. I usually would go over my lines in pencil and then d do the inking, but I, I was like, I want to try it this way. And this was my first time filming my light box. So yeah, I went over it with my eraser and then I got all the eraser shavings off. And that was me sort of showing you what I'd be doing. Um, I decided to do grayscale because I figured it'd be great practice instead of finding the right colors and everything, just doing that. Um, and I also just got these grays and I really wanted to test them out. I'm really awkward at drawing necks, I see this, or like, not drawing them, coloring them. Um, my style has changed quite a lot since my last original, like, drawing that I did completely out of my head, because Ashton, I used someone else's cartoon drawing as reference. I did draw it myself, but the drawing I used was reference. And it was by Itz Lopez on Instagram, and I believe it's Laya Lopez on YouTube, so, yeah. So, um, for the skin, I used the lightest one, since I'm, as you can see, I'm really pale. Um, for the jeans, I used darker ones. I don't really remember what colors. I think it was 13, 14, and I meant to grab 15, but I grabbed 16, so I had to make make it work. Um, these are all the Prismacolor Cool Grays, by the way. Um, and the eyebrows. I have really dark, bushy eyebrows. <laughs> and I need to get my hair done. All the roots. Um, so, the reason why the camera will shake sometimes is because I had my phone plugged in so it wouldn't die on me, and I also had my headphones plugged in so I could jam, and I kept bumping the cords. Um, the reason I colored the sweater like this in sections was just to make it easier on me, and also to, um, because I learned that these markers blend really well, like these particular markers blend really well when you work quickly, which is what I tried to do. Um, yeah. So, I colored in sections. These ones were the same colors as the eyes, so I think it was 10, 11, and 12. Well, 1, 10, 1, 11, 1, 12. They all have ones before them. And that's what I was doing through here. And I figured I would just do the, um... The mid-tones for lots of things, like the eyes, too. Um, I'm going in and doing, fixing things. This is when, um, I do have all these colors swatched, I know what they look like, but I wasn't, like, 100% sure as to which one was what. And I was doing the hair, so I wanted to find the good tones, that's what I did. I didn't go super detailed on the hair, mainly because I'm not, I'm not comfortable with that yet. I can do it in pencil, but not, you know, everything else. And as you saw, I have Attack on Titan headphones, because why the hell not? Um, the hair was pretty simple. 
If you want me to do a tutorial on how I colored this hair, I can do that. Or on how I colored anything, I can do that. The hair is just sort of all over the place. Um, so this video will be over relatively soon. So yeah, I colored around all the bumps in hair because curls. And then when I went in with the white, I tried to differentiate the lips because the lip and the shadow of the lip became one. And this is me fixing up all the lines I went over. Um, I went with the eyes, shines on the glasses, the neck, some fingers. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys again soon, hopefully. Bye-bye.